Hey there, welcome back to Vox Pulse. Today, we've got an exciting story that's making headlines across the nation. It's a tale of football, pop music, and an unexpected invitation. I'm your host, your name, and we're diving deep into the world of Taylor Swift's open invitation from the NFL. It all began when two-time Super Bowl-winning Kansas City Chiefs tight end Travis Kelsey decided to make a bold move. He extended an invitation to none other than global megastar Taylor Swift to attend one of his football games. Why, you ask? Well, to impress her, of course. And believe it or not, Taylor Swift accepted the invitation. The moment she stepped into the football arena, chaos ensued among her fan base, affectionately known as the Swifties. Swifties from all corners of the nation took to the internet to share their excitement. Even those who weren't regular football enthusiasts found themselves tuning into the game. It was a Sunday afternoon activity out of the ordinary for many, but Taylor Swift has a way of bringing people together, doesn't she? Now, let's talk about why this is such a big deal for the National Football League. It's no secret that they've been trying to attract a younger audience, especially Gen Z and young American women. Taylor Swift's massive fan base, primarily composed of millennial women, immediately tuned in to watch the Chiefs Bears game on September 24. The result? It became the most watched NFL broadcast of the week with a whopping 24.3 million viewers. But what's even more remarkable is that it was the highest rated game of the week for women between the ages of 12 to 49. The game resonated particularly well with young women. It ranked first in viewership among women aged 12 to 17, 18 to 34, and 18 to 49. In fact, there was a staggering 63% increase in women viewers aged 18 to 49 from the Chiefs' previous game. This renewed attention to the NFL's growing fan base of American women and Gen Z is sparking discussions about the league's relationship with these groups. In recent years, the NFL has faced numerous scandals related to mistreatment of women within the league and by its players. Additionally, Gen Z audiences consume entertainment differently from older generations of football fans, making them a challenging demographic for the league to reach. However, on that fateful Sunday, the NFL capitalized on the frenzy by changing its social media channel descriptions to NFL, Taylor's version. The league has been actively trying to gain traction with Gen Z by leveraging different players' interests outside of football. But they do face some hurdles along the way. And finally, a word from Ian Trombetta, a senior vice president of social and influencer marketing for the NFL, who revealed that they weren't aware of Taylor Swift's attendance until the day of the game. Still, they were closely watching the situation unfold. So, there you have it, the incredible story of how Taylor Swift's open invitation from the NFL became a Hail Mary pass to win over Gen Z and female fans. It just goes to show the power of music and sports when they come together. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more fascinating stories from the world of entertainment, sports, and pop culture. I'm Emma, and until next time, stay tuned.